why Jelly Roll says after losing at Barmageddon, his spirits broke. Rather than singing his hit song of the same name, Jelly Roll may have yelled save me as he left the Barmageddon set. Everything is revealed in Ed's exclusive first look at Monday night's episode, which pits comedian Gabrielle Fluffy Iglesias against country music star Theo Armada in a round of foreplay, a game that ups the ante on foosball-style soccer to the real world. Both Jelly and Fluffy are goalies for their respective teams, Jelly has Blake Shelton as an ally, while Fluffy is paired with Carson Dolly. The match takes a wild turn when host and referee Nikki Garcia brings a four fourth ball onto the field. Balls start flying past faces and occasionally hitting heads. Carson slams a ball across the field and straight past Jelly as Nikki counts down the final seconds of the game, giving Team Fluffy the victory. Jelly apologizes for not blocking the shot as she collapses into Blake's arms. In an attempt to hype up the series return last month, Blake told it, I'm proud of the fact that it's the stupidest show in television history. Blake's wife Gwen Stefani made a guest appearance in season two, but instead of working together as a team, the two had to compete against one another. What's funny is, we had a guy that had to cancel, for personal reasons, that Gwen was gonna go against, who I'm hoping I'll get back for the next season, but it just so happens that I wanted to beat my wife, personally, at Barmageddon, Blake said. They appear to be a competitive family.